from rocking chair to runner-up. <laughs> a part-time presence last season, a full-blown championship contender this year. This driver turned back the clock, having arguably the best year of a NASCAR career that dates to 1981. NASCAR Sprint Cup Series, second place, Mark Martin. My real role model was my dad. And then coming up through the ranks, you know, I raced with a lot of, of drivers that I really looked up to. Uh, Richard Petty, you know, and then I made friends with uh, Bobby Allison and Daryl Waltrip. From the years that I started racing, having, you know, fans coming up and getting my autograph, and it's that kind of support all the way through that really makes it all work. They may call him the old man, but he hasn't forgotten how to win a race. Well, Mark Martin has waited for four years to go back to victory lane, and he has done it. Pimples out of gas. Martin takes the lead in turn number three. We got him, baby. Is going to win for the third time this year. Woo! I can't believe we won! Checkered flag is out. Mark Martin wins. I can't believe it. Man, that's big. That is big. Mark, you didn't win. You crushed the baby. The yellow flag and the checkered flag for Mark Martin as he will win at New Hampshire. The most important thing that to me is, is that I've had fun. This has been the most fun that I ever remember having. I've been really happy and having a good time. Please welcome driver of the number five Kellogg's CarQuest Chevrolet from Batesville, Arkansas, Mark Martin. March seven polls this year was a single season career best total. Thank you, guys. I want to thank Sprint and NASCAR for bringing this banquet out here to Las Vegas. It's been a big time. Um, I really, really have enjoyed it. And I really want to thank all the NASCAR fans everywhere, but especially those longtime fans of mine that have been with me through all the ups and downs and were always there uh, cheering me on and supporting me. But there was another whole group this year that came on board as our uh, performance started to really build uh, momentum through the season. And uh, most of that group was my age or maybe even a little bit older. Uh, that was really fun. I, I can't tell you how much it meant to me. It seemed like every driver's intro from the middle of the season on the roar got a little bit louder. It was truly incredible. It really meant a lot to me. I've got a hot date tonight too, guys. <laughs> Arlene, I still remember how I felt 26 years ago when, uh, when we met. It was a little funny feeling down here, kind of like butterflies. I remember because I still get that today. You've been the best thing that ever happened to me. Jimmy Johnson, man, you sure know how to steal a guy's thunder, don't you? <laughs> Congratulations, man. You really work hard at it, and you are so incredible, and you are going to get the credit that you deserve one day. Keep it up, buddy. <laughs> um, and Chad, I've watched firsthand how hard you work for the credit that you get, and you earn it. Congratulations to you and everybody on that team. You guys are incredible. Mr. Rick Hendrick, man, you just win everything there is in NASCAR. You know, you make history, win all these championships. You're a big winner. Congratulations, and thanks for letting me be a part of it. But that's not the most imp impressive part of it. To me, you are a true champion as a person, such an incredible individual that affects so many people 
in a positive way. And uh, I'd like to be more like you. I've had a great year this year working with uh, Kellogg's and uh, representing all the great products. Uh, it was a blast. And I want to thank all the, the uh, CarQuest teammates all over the country for letting me be a part of their team. Um, it's really been fun, and I look forward to doing that again next year. Um, I want to congratulate uh, Chevrolet on their 33rd uh, Manufacturers Championship. Believe me, I know how the competition feels, because I was one of those for many, many years. You really know how to frustrate the competition. Um, and I'd like to invite everybody to check us out in 2009 at GoDaddy.com. Uh, go uh, there's a lot of great partners and sponsors that uh, are involved at Hendrick Motorsports. And uh, I'd like to thank Stanley, Adidas, and as you can see, I don't have them on yet, but I will be changing shortly. Um, Delphi, Bosch, Bank of America, Freightliner, National Guard, Pure Later, Quaker State, Siemens, and Time Order Cable. Um, also like to, to thank uh, Wally X, uh, ER Extra, and Goodyear for all their support. All the success we had this year wouldn't be, you know, wouldn't be possible without great people. And uh, Alan Gustafson is such an amazing combination of education, uh, technical understanding and know-how, and hands-on at the racetrack practicality, all mold molded together. He's such a strong person and a great leader, uh, a loyal friend, um, and we really have good communication and chemistry. A couple of things that make that work. One thing that I'm really proud of is that he's not intimidated by, um, by my experience, uh, although he respects it, and uh, that's important. But I think the most important part is that uh, I know how much smarter he is than me, so I just pretty much keep my mouth shut and listen. Uh, I want to thank everybody that ever put their hands on that five car, all the team. Um, they are so excited and so charged up. I could feel the energy every day that I went to work and it made it so much fun. And every time I sit down in that five car, I realize that it's the nicest thing that I've ever been in. Um, it's really, really awesome to have a team, a team that wins together and that, that fails together. We have each other's back um, and it really feels good. But it goes way beyond that. You know, I want to uh, thank the engine shop, the chassis shop, and the fabricators, because I return it to them tore up pretty often, and they return it right back to me like brand new. Uh, incredible job. I want to congratulate everyone, every man and woman at Henrik Motorsports on making history this year on multiple fronts. Your dedication to excellence is unparalleled in motorsports, and I see a little bit of Rick Hendrick in each and every one of them. Um, it's just, uh, it's, it's really, really cool. And I want to thank Chad, um, Steve Latart, um, Lance McGrew, and Tony Uri Jr. for welcoming me inside their circle. I can't tell you what a thrill it's been for me to work with them. And uh, my teammates, Jeff Gordon, Dale Earnhardt Jr., and Jimmy Johnson, these three guys have awesome strengths in different areas that I was able to draw from that made me a better person and a better race car driver. I have some really uh, important people around me that uh, keep all the wheels rolling in the same direction so that I can focus on racing and not worry about the rest of the stuff. Arlene, Benny Ertel, Kent Dewey, Lance Landers, Laura Buck, and Bart Starr do a great job. They're very committed. And I just want to thank everyone for uh, making 2009 a year that I will always remember. Thank you all. God bless you.